so this shalom is actually going to prevent stretch mark this is a stretch mark oil it's very good for stretch marks and this one is tube because this this ones are the tubes i'll be using today koji clear and glutathione if you guys have been following me for a while now you should know this is my best this is my new favorite so this one is pimento very popular one this is very very good for lightning this one is going to prevent stretch mark green vein a uh, very coarse vein on the leg i don't have shalom oil i know that for things they are not here yet so that's why i'm not using it so this is the white now i'll be using you can see it's very small this is like one tablespoon so this is the one i'll be using today and this is my favorite oil this is a very very strong oil for lightning this one is pj own this is very very strong this is a very strong serum so you can see i'm not adding a lot in this lotion so this oil i told you guys that this is like one tablespoon right so this is it i was right oh <laughs> let's just say one okay let's see two two and quarter so this is white now This is my 24 hours oil. I add three tablespoon. That is it. We are not adding too many things. See, it's not by adding a lot of things. That's why your lotion will work. No, you don't need to add too many things to your lotion before it will work. All right, so I will add one of this glutathione injection because that my base cream, man. Eh? I didn't add this one to it, so that's the reason why I want to put it to make it more active. This is a very very strong tube that is why it is expensive it is very very expensive so that is it i will add my rapid white nizer just one tablespoon you know this uh, rapid white nizer is very small This is a very very small bottle so even if you add everything to it not like it's going to give you anything in your body like this coloration or something like that it's actually going to make your lotion work very well like if you have eczema on your body white dust this is actually going to help you can see it's very small so this is like basically two tablespoon this is a very very small container So I will add one of this um, pimento. So I'm adding one pimento to it. So this is my lotion already, my base cream. I'm just reactivating it. So you see it's already this is a lightning lotion already 
So this uh, can acquire we add just one tablespoon. You don't need too much when you're adding this. That will prevent stretch mark. It's very good to always apply it when you are making lotion so you, your customers will not have stretch mark. So this PJ one, eh? I will add just one tablespoon to it. This is the last one I have in this house, so I don't want to use everything. Yes, that is enough. This is the last one I have. Okay, bear a cloth can I call. I wish you guys can see how big this is. This is very, very big. Oh. For people that will start saying, why is she adding everything now? You know, a lot of people, they are like that. So guys, that is all we need to add to this lotion. We don't need too much. level you can see how we have a lot now i had to add some products to balance it okay so this is it our lotion is ready guys this lotion is very very active this is a very very strong mix because that my lotion i mixed with it is a very very strong lotion already so that is the reason why we have this now so guys um i didn't really use the hand mixer too much because I don't want to add and incorporate too much air to the lotion. So when you're making lotions, be very careful so you know, like give your lotion too much air. So this is it. This lotion is very, very strong, very active. So guys, my class is starting very, very soon. If you're not following me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. So you get updated anytime I have new, like you get notified anytime I have new updates about my class. Okay, I'm so sorry. I wanted to do this class this month, but I'm very, very busy. You know, it's the holiday season. A lot of people want to buy products. So this is actually one of my busy time. You can see. 